Howdy y'all, and welcome back to I Am Abled Because I Am Is Able. So you might notice the Christmas tree is still behind me, and I am in a Santa Claus outfit. <laughs> and you might be wondering, why in April am I still doing that? Well, as you know, I've had some setback days, some setback weeks, um, and I had every intention of filming all my cup of cheer stuff um, over a month ago, something like that, about a month and a half ago. And then I had a major setback, and I couldn't get my head out of a brain fog, and I couldn't hold a book to read, so I couldn't do my story times, and I couldn't do what I wanted to do for my series. I have some plans, but they might get pushed back to my 2019 series. We'll see. So we kept this up. My parents have been awesome. They've been very patient with me. But with my procedure coming up, and summer right after that, my mom is really needing some sanity in the house and has asked that we take the tree down this week before my procedure. And it'd be best if Dad could be able to help us. So I spent today and yesterday filming. And this is kind of a big deal. One, because I hate seeing Christmas go away. And my dogs hate Christmas going away. But two, because I had a raging, and still do, a headache, neck ache, and emotion-filled weekend. Uh, I have barely gotten any sleep. And last night I was actually nauseous from pain. So that God gave me enough strength to do this video today. I did two videos for the Cup of Cheer and I'm doing this right now. It is a pretty big deal because I know I have not done this under my own strength today. Totally honest. So, real quick with them. That bedding there, they've put it there. They love being by the Christmas tree. One of those things is a pillow that I put there, yes. For me. <laughs> to meditate and pray by the tree. And I haven't been able to get up and down very well on my own from the ground, so I've only used it a few times since we put the tree up. Um, but they have decided, you know what? Sissy had a good idea. So I think they're gonna miss the tree too. <laughs> Anyhow, um, yeah, so it's been a really bad or rough weekend. Uh, and I'm sad to see this go. Look at how it shimmers. Look how beautiful it is. <laughs> but I know that it's important to also have some time without it, too. Um, there's more seating in the room when the tree is out. And it's easier to get in and out of the door, stuff like that. You know, little things like that. And uh, my mom needs some sense of normalcy in the house, so for her that means not Christmas. And I can appreciate that. So I filmed enough Cup of Cheer videos that I can assure you we will at least have a handful of Cup of Cheer this year, and we'll see what happens from there. Uh, so how have you been able this weekend in ways that you know were not your own? Like, Maybe you didn't have the strength of your own will to drive to church today because you were exhausted or to get the kids to their party or whatever it may be today. Maybe you're in an area where it's snowing or raining cats and dogs and yet still somehow God gave you strength to do something today. I'd love to hear what it is. Um, you can leave the comments below or whatever. So thanks for being along for this journey. There might be more videos of us actually taking this tree down. Or maybe not. We'll see. Anyhow, ciao for now. <laughs>